January, 2021, February, we really honed in on it. And that's where like bringing in my cousin more often, like having him in the content. Yeah. Um, so we started filming on the weekends when he'd be off work every Saturday, Sunday, film two days when I was there. So it's like, okay, I got him for four days total. <laughs> so we made a bunch of content that would work on my page. And then we launched his page. And then we brought in my grandma, like on a whim one day, like just totally, she was, she lives there on the farm. Mm -hmm. So that turned into a whole nother thing that now has been a huge blessing for us. And it's so great. I get to do it, but like, the day that happened, it changed the game for us. <laughs> Take me to that first day then. We, you know, grandma just comes out and says, what are you guys doing? It says, actually, come on in. Like, how does that all happen? How does she get in the first video? And then, you know, fast forward then after you get through that to how does she feel about everything now? Just thinking about it, like how it all happened is to truly like, kind of like how our content still happens this day. <laughs> like, it's, it's very funny, but like up to that point, we started getting popular with these called Farm Stuff with Daryl episodes, which was like, I was trying to be educational, funny, and entertaining all at the same time in like quick 30 second videos about farming, ranching stuff around the farm. And I think we had just done one about the trailer hitch, uh, where like the trailer hitch is known to be the B like of the farm, like it's shin killer. Like you walk by and you hit that thing every time. And so we just made that video and someone had said something about like, uh, I can't remember what it was. They said something about, uh, about a grandma. Like, yeah, but imagine like my, my that took out my granny one day. And then uh, somebody also said, I, so I made a reference into the very next farm stuff video. Uh, we were way, we did the one finger wave. I don't know if you in Oklahoma, you're familiar with like when people pass here, they do that. So that, that's a huge in the farming community. Uh, so we did a video about what all the different signs mean. And then a car passes us in the video. I go, I wonder if that was granny. And like to, to gate Bart. <laughs> and so, and then people go like, who's granny so then in a video i just remember she's out in the yard and this is we've started to not only do the farm stuff videos but like play off our characters within a social media world and farming so i'm sitting there and like you can stitch videos on tiktok and there's always girls you know dancing in bikinis and all this stuff and i'm like how do we make fun of this without being like vulgar or what and so i was like what if i stitch it and go like and like ask my gram grandma my granny uh like what does she think of this lovely young lady for me? Uh, because at this point, like we'd never classified who like Daryl's a farm boy who lives on the farm with his grandma. So I'm like, well, obviously he's not married or <laughs> we haven't got this figured out yet. So uh, we just kind of ran with this and I'd show her my like, granny and look at this lady. And like, she comes over to the phone <laughs> and she just like her, this, her real reaction was like, these, gr these hussies on this thing, like, this is what they're doing. I go, I said, we got to stop. We got to re redo that grandma. What'd you call them? And she's like, uh, they're hussies. I go, yes, I know. What the, I know. The, and she's always called like girls who are very flaunty out there that. Um, and I'm like, we got to say this on, on, on the thing. She goes, I'm not going to say that on, on a camera. People, people will cancel me. And I said, no, it'll, it's funny. Cause you're old, like older, you can get away with it. I said you and babies, it's different between the elderly people and babies. You guys can get away with a lot more than regular people can. So we, we, I hit the stitch button and she goes, she slaps me. She goes, Daryl, that's a hussy. You leave them alone. And I go, yes, granny. And like, that's where it just totally took off and people go who's granny and like what we want more of this lady so i just started like throwing every once in a while have her in bits like kind of like scolding us getting on to us and uh and that's where my brain from like a storytelling standpoint was like this is a great element of like a, a mother son relationship a grandmother her grandson relationship because we kind of had the buddy comedy thing going to me and gay bar but i was like how can and like this is where you can get really family and more personal and stuff so if, and i get to do it with my grandma who like I've known her my whole life, so I know how to direct her. But she also is very good at listening to my directions. So, like, and when I was young, she did not listen to anything I said. She wouldn't even let me have sugar in my sweet tea or my tea. So, like, this and Granny growing up was not. She was my my more stern grandma. So, not the fun grandma as much. Uh, but uh, now she's like this like full of life, 80 year old lady, um, always up down for whatever. So I told her to do something. She's like, sure, I'll do it. So, uh, we, we started just having her in the content and then took off. And then I think in like April or May or something, we launched, like we made her own TikTok page just for fun. And like within a month, she had a hundred thousand followers. We're like, well, it took me, I was like, that took me eight, nine months of grinding. And she, <laughs> she posted like two videos and had a hundred thousand followers yeah. on well, uh, TikTok. And the great part about it is that she's literally just being herself. Yeah. Right. You're, she doesn't have to act like you've been, you've gone through school to act and all this stuff yeah. to do this little storyline. You're just like, granny do this. And she's like, okay, like, yeah. you don't have to like, <laughs> it's the best thing about it. Cause, and then again, so many people are relating to her because you know, their grandma's like that or their mum's like that. Right. It's yeah. just so good. But yeah, I did. I looked 
looked up her Instagram before we started recording. She's at 100,000 followers on Instagram. Yeah, yeah she like, just hit that a couple weeks ago. And we just launched that actually in April of this year. That's crazy. Yeah, like we didn't, some people didn't, don't go there. Like Some people are like, how have you done that? Well, you know, because all they want to do is get to 10K or whatever it is, right? Yeah. Like, it's just it's like, <laughs> you know, it's it's amazing. how. And obviously, GateBots is growing now. I think yeah. it's close to 10,000. Yeah, right, we actually, it's so funny. Like, his old one, we have something happened with it. And, like, he was not, like, we'd post a video, it'd go viral on TikTok, or even on my page. But his old Instagram account wouldn't. So yeah. we would just, I'm like, we should just start you a new one. So we, like, faked it, like fake it this is all part of like the story movie. yeah the story yeah. so he's like i can't log in my instagram and like we had a whole video about it like and so we're like we just gotta make you a new one and granny like in a second goes here i already made you a new one and he's like you're really good at this social media stuff grandma uh so so we did that in like in two months now and it being consistent with his content it's like twelve thousand followers in yeah. two months which i to me is like still that's a that's a great accomplishment that's amazing for a, you know we can like he's he's a, a secondary sidekick and like he's only films with us still three or four days a month so yeah. and, you know that we get to do that is it's pretty cool and grow and grow the, them but uh just the how it all has all has happened like thinking back now it's like wow it's just like all on a whim cousin right. doing that grandma doing that and now we're it's all nuts like, yeah. like 